It's time to stock up ponds with fish and the Lucas Soil and Water Conservation District is helping new and established pond owners do that pretty easily. Jessica Greiser is with us this afternoon from SWCD so we can learn all about this sale coming up. So we're selling fish. <laughs> Tell me a little bit about the sale. Yeah, so this is our spring fish sale and we're offering whether they're new pond owners or existing pond owners the opportunity to stock their ponds with fish and it's a pretty easy process. They order and they come. It's like almost a drive through they just mm -hmm. come pick up their fish and send them on their way okay so what kind of fish are we talking about so we have five different kinds of fish available mm -hmm. uh, largemouth bass yellow perch channel catfish minnows and then bluegill so anybody who owns a pond are we talking about maybe farmers or you know just your standard homeowner or what's the target here? yeah anybody that has a pond so um, you know usually with those kinds of fish they're larger ponds that people either fish out of or or they're just for you know to add um, some natural amenities back mm -hmm. to their property mm -hmm. um, but yeah we've actually been getting interest from HOAs in the area so um, really any anybody that has a pond okay so is there maybe a conservation you know benefit here to having the fish or? yeah so the the species that we offer um, are kind of just good standard fish to have in your pond and it creates a balance of predator versus prey in your pond so we provide stocking recommendations and um, none of them are um, invasive species so there's that benefit as well um, so again they just kind of add that natural benefit but also people like to fish for these mm -hmm. um, fish and <laughs> harvest them and eat them so there's that benefit too yeah and you know what this could be a really fun learning experience maybe you have kids or anything like that to, to learn how to fish and just to learn to just enjoy you exactly. know? being outside yeah. and enjoying, enjoying all that comes with that. I think you also have another product that you're selling along with that. It's a pond conditioner. Yes. So <laughs> the the place that we actually get the fish from, because we're kind of a middleman, but they have this product that um, if people are having trouble with the water quality in their pond and they want to um, fix that in a more natural, organic way, they have this pond conditioner that has all these different things in it that um, can clear up pond muck or... Um, really just kind of enhance and, and improve the water quality that okay. they see. So yeah. they can buy that as well. Yes. So you said it's an easy process. So do they order ahead of time, like online, or do they need to be doing that now, probably? Yes, so um, the order, you can order online now. It's a pre-order, so that goes up until May 9th. Mm -hmm. And then um, the pickup, it's a one-hour pickup window on May 16th. And they come to the Lucas County Fairgrounds uh, between 10.30 and 11.30 on that day in the morning. And um, it's like a drive through They pull up. We pull. Their order and and the um, fish hatchery um, grabs the fish and we put them in buckets and send them on their way. Ah, in buckets. Okay, yes. so yeah, do pe do people come with coolers or pickup trucks or how do they, how do they usually come? <laughs> it's recommended that they bring five gallon buckets um, lined with unscented plastic bags because okay. you don't want the fish swimming around in anything that mm -hmm. they shouldn't be mm -hmm. and um, and also f half filled with pond water from their pond so okay. that the fish can get used to the temperature mm -hmm. and then um, the fish will get counted and pulled off the truck mm -hmm. put into the buckets that the customer brings mm -hmm. and then they add oxygen tie them off and then um, tell them to dump them in their pond right when they get home okay very cool so mm -hmm. a, an interesting thing if you're interested in that make sure to get your orders in uh, for folks who also like nature but maybe they are, they're more of the plant type mm -hmm. you have something going on with that as well yes so on Friday May 10th we have our backyard conservation and native plant sale so we um, are really just celebrating all things conservation at our office in Toledo and we'll be selling native plants um, but also things like rain barrels composters hmm. soil test kits bird houses um, all different kinds of things just again trying to make it easy for folks to implement conservation on their properties. Because we're talking native plants here. So native you plants, want to make sure yes. the species are where they're supposed to be. Exactly. And so how could people uh, get orders in for that? So that's not a pre-order. That's okay. just more of like an open house style event where people come um, that day between 3 and 6.30. Mm -hmm. And um, it's kind of a first come, first serve. What's available is what we have. But um, we're hoping that it's a fun event. We're going to have a children's activity and some other agencies having information tables. So it's a little bit more than just a sale. It's just kind of a, a way to kick off the spring and summer and get excited about planting. Yeah. yeah. So fish, 
plants, all of the things. You all are busy. Where can people <laughs> go to get all the information they need? They can go to our website, which is um, lucaswcd.org, or we have a Facebook page. Um, they can find us, Lucas Soil and Water. Very good. Jessica, thank you so much for being here thank today. Thank you. We appreciate it.